Uh, this is a demonstration of long spine board or cervical board application. I'm first going to start with my scene safety BSI precautions. At this point, I'm going to direct my partner to start manual stabilization of the head in a neutral inline position. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to assess CMS. You pinch your fingers. Thank you. Press down. Pull up. All right. Which toe am I pressing on? My big toe. All right. Which finger am I grabbing? My thumb. All right. At this point, I'm then going to do a full head to toe check, checking for any deformities, anything else. If none are indicated, I can continue on with my cervical uh, collar application. I'm going to take my collar, properly size it to my patient. All right. At this point, I will then slide it underneath. and apply my collar. During this whole time, my partner will be holding manual stabilization. I'm going to do rapid head to toe, check for any uh, bleeding or deformities. If there's none, I will continue on. A good uh, acronym to check for bleeding or deformities is DCAP ETLS. At that point, I will then direct my partner to hold manual stabilization while I roll the patient. I'm then going to roll the patient onto her side. Check for any deformities using DQLP to less. If there's none present, I'll then ask my additional partner to position the backboard. You're then going to roll on the count of three. One, two, three. Once the patient's in position, we can manually move her using a Z-drag. So we'll go down to the feet. Go ahead and grab on the side there. Like this. Z drag down, the other hand here. Z drag down, and back up. Once in position, I'm gonna then check for CMS again. So I have strong pulses. Excuse my fingers. Which finger am I grabbing? My thumb. All right, I'm gonna check the toe with the fingers. Assess the repeal pulse. Press down, pull up. Which toe am I grabbing? A big one. Which toe am I grabbing? Big one. At that point, I'm then going to Secure the patient using the straps and the headboard. I'm going to position the headboard underneath. And my partner is going to continue holding manual stabilization of this. And then I'm going to apply my straps. Going over the chest and the hips. Being sure to keep any limbs or arms out of the way. Unconscious or conscious, I'll have to secure their arms in an X pattern. And I'll then strap over their arms to secure them to the board. Once that strap is in place, I want to do my feet and my hip straps. Tuck any straps in out of the way. To this point, I'm then going to secure the head, carrying the last, going over the head and over the chin area. Secure the 
Austrian headlock and the head. And then the chin area. And that is long spine board mobilization.